Hey guys, what's going on? This is Brian from the YouTube channel Classic G Body Garage, and today I'm gonna do a DIY and drive tutorial for pull apart used auto parts. All right, today I'm gonna be removing the starter off this 2004 Chevy Impala. It has the 3400 V6, so let me go ahead, grab my tools, and show you exactly what we need to get this starter removed. For this pull, we're gonna need a 3 8 and quarter inch ratchet, a pair of 3 8 inch extensions, a quarter, quarter inch extension, a 10, 15, 8, and 13 millimeter socket. So the first thing I need to do is remove the inspection cover, which is held on by three bolts, three 10 millimeter bolts, one here on the front, and then two here on the bottom. Remove the inspection cover. So the fasteners are located on the front here and in the rear right there. Loosen them up just a bit. You don't want to take them completely out because you don't want the starter abruptly falling out. So we got that one loose. Front one, now let's get the back one. And if the starter does happen to drop out, the wires are still attached to it, so it's not gonna fall completely out. All right, next thing I'm gonna do is remove the wire from the solenoid. That takes an eight millimeter socket. It's always a good to hang on to these little nuts and bolts because you're not sure if you might need them when you put the starter back on your vehicle. All right, now I'm gonna remove the main electrical connector, which is held on by a 13 millimeter nut. And put the nut back on there. All right, the rear bolt. Continue removing that one. And that starter is gonna get loose. You gotta make sure it's not gonna fall out on you. All right, tug it out of there, and there you go. Starter's removed. So this is how you pull the starter on a 3400 General Motors V6. And that's it guys. This is Brian from Classic G Body Garage. Thanks for watching.